I have these headphones. Actually, I got another pair. This is my second pair. Um, these headphones are awesome. These headphones are light. Like, they're incredibly light. To be honest, they're even more light than these headphones. At first, you'll be like, um, I, I find that hard to believe. But these are actually lighter. They're bigger. It hugs the ear. And at the best, at the same time, too, when you put it into the, um, when you're recording ad libs and stuff like that, these headphones won't leak. So basically, this is a um, unboxing type of thing slash review. I got these from Sam Ash. Sam Ash. When I went to the store, Sam Ash wanted them for twenty four dollars. I'm twenty nine dollars and ninety five cents. Online, it costs really twenty four dollars. Um, I went to the store, had a paper with me, and because I had the paper with me, they um, basically brought down the price for me because they realized that, you know, it's not the same thing. Maybe there's a default, or maybe they're trying to hustle the customers. I'm trying to keep that extra $5, but... Um, yeah, so this is how the front looks like. If you hear the little sound thingy, it's Joe talking to his female friends. Female friends. But this is the front. Okay, Joe King. I think you're going to have to put that away. Put on mute. But this is the front. This is cool. This is the side. This is the back. It has like, you know, it has all the language stuff, English, it has like the feature stuff in English, Dutch, blah blah blah, Italian, Portuguese, Netherlands, in the bottom it has like the technical information, stuff like that, um, then on the other side it's this, the headphones are cool like that, so we can unbox. Oh, and the top looks like that. Bottom looks like this. With that sticker thing. I'm gonna unbox it. So, when you unbox it. Okay. Comes in like this. Really nothing. Special. So, it's all formed up. Again, it's light. It's incredibly light. It's surprisingly light. It's surprisingly light and it's like, it's more built. Like, I feel like it's more built. It's built a lot more better. So this is... Okay, dude. It's missing a little thingy, I think. Oh, okay. It's the other one. I'm gonna place the other one, too. Well, this is how it looks like. Size. It has the logo. As the logo, top, it's nice and big, you can put your ears and stuff, covers it up, hugs it and everything, um, comes with this adapter, which is cool, because, um, with this adapter, you can put it in your laptop and stuff like that, because I hate it when they have the really big ones, and it sucks because sometimes you just want to put it on your iPod and stuff. So basically, you can use it. Um, um, another thing too, guys. I made the same mistake last time. The you know the six point three stereo adapter. Is actually inside in this thing right here and inside this thing's folded in there so don't even bother looking in there because I did the same thing last time and I was like okay actually this comes in the packaging it's a gold tip so sound quite good both they're actually both gold tip now the thing is with these headphones these headphones are not your beats these headphones are not your skull heads. 
these headphones are studio headphones that a lot of people use for reference. These are usually like stereo reference headphones. So, don't be surprised if you're not hearing the bass that you expect to be hearing from your from your little beats because one your beats have enhanced soundings it's not going to be the same thing like if you have a beat headphones and this it's not going to sound the same your beats headphone will have a crap little bass but when you put it to something else it will not sound the same so for all the people that has their little studios and has beats in their studio that they think is nice and cool because it's coming from Dre they're not reference headphones those headphones are like those headphones are just cool to have an mp3 type of thing and my house coming down the hallway Mahal you wanna say hi? oh god no uh it's just aiming down here oh we saw your feet <laughs> so like hint to the people to the young producers out there and stuff uh, whoa, focus. For the young producers out there and stuff, there's two types of headphones. There's media headphones and there's reference headphones. These are studio reference headphones. These headphones will sound completely different from your little, from your, I don't know, $600 Scala headphones or Bose headphones or Beats headphones. Because I've been seeing a lot of people running around. Oh, focus, come on. I've been seeing a lot of people running around with Beats headphones. And I'm watching them and I'm realizing, like, I just want to knock at their door telling them, I hope you know those Beats headphones will not deliver the same accurate sounding that you should be having. Because these people are actually trying to master with beats, and beats have enhanced bass and enhanced tr treble. Again, they are enhanced, meaning MP3 that you master them with. By the time when you send it off to another person, that person with a headphone like these or headphones as a different headphones, it will not sound the same. So, if you think you're doing the correct thing by spending hundreds, thousands on Beats headphones for your home studio, you are making an incredible big mistake. Just because it's expensive and it's vouchered by Dre don't mean that their headphones that are the best. So yeah, this is my review the the headphones, the bombs. I tried it. Mahal tried it. Red Mahal, you tried it, right? Yeah, that's good. Mahal tried it. Mahal likes a little bass thing. Ma Mahal, I, I guess it's I good like from. More bass, yeah, Mahal likes the enhanced headphones. Me, I like the reference headphones. If you're hearing a little buzz sound thingy, it's because we, I'm actually in the living room and we have a tank. We have two tanks, so that's the little water sound thingy. So it sounds if it sounds like somebody's peeing, nobody is peeing. Oh, but but I wait too. Like these headphones. Um, it doesn't matter if left and right, they bend exactly the same and stuff like that, so it's all good. Oh, it does make a difference. Well, I don't know. But, like, you know, if you're one of those people that don't really care and just want to put in your ear, you know, these actually, there's no special molding and stuff like that, but, you know, all the way on the sides. They have like the R in the left. Again, these are the Sennheiser HD 201. The bomb. I give. I give this. I give. I give this. Um. Well, out of all my reference, I give this a ten. Cause it is awesome. It's light. When I do recordings, it don't hurt your ears. When I had these, it hurt your ears. You have it in your ears and at the same time, like, it becomes annoying. Your ear would sweat in these. I don't even want to imagine all these people that sweat in these because I even sweat in these. These, it's breathable, it's easy, it's comfortable. 
Um, it feels good. It looks cool. And it, like, it's just awesome. Peace. Is all filled up Back then They said it wasn't happening Now they released the crack thing Cause I'm feeling so gargantuan And I'm out of space Star Trekking Captain Kirk Martin